Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Repentance. Now, I'm thinking today we're going to give Eve one more try. I mean, we've given, it, we've given it a couple attempts, a couple dozen runs over the last couple episodes, and it's gone pretty terribly. So PF3QM1C1. Yesterday's episode, if you haven't seen it already, first of all, you should see it. So, like, pause this video, heck, and go to the playlist, I don't know. That's another thing, I don't know if I should put the playlist in the description of the videos, but eh, whatever. But yeah, so pause the video, go watch that one first, because I'm about to heck and talk about it. I, I know usually I try to avoid, first of all, dying in the second room, but we don't need to talk about that. L334HWLE. But, uh, yeah. Pain. Alright, well, that's that's it about the last episode. Nah, I'm kidding. I don't know. I don't really... I don't really remember much about the last episode. All I remember is the fact that we got a deal with the devil with 16% chances, like five floors in a row, when we had a 22% chance for a deal with an angel. And that's still only a 38% chance for a deal. Like, what the heck, Isaac? Man, you gotta be kidding me. I thought I got lucky with that one run a couple episodes ago where uh, where we were like really where we like got Mega Satan like one health and died. I thought that was a lucky run because I got like one thirty eight percent chance two floors before I needed like before it was the last deal. What the heck is this garbage, Isaac? I am upset with you. I am absolutely fuming. Big Angie. And and we made it to the chest too. Like we made it to the chest without taking a single deal in Isaac. That's that's a rare commodity. There's, there's not many times where you don't take any deals in Isaac. Seller or wait no, what was, what was that card? I don't know. I I read seller one because I thought that was the card name for a second. Ace of Spades, luck of the draw. Uh, maybe a few of luck based tier effects. It makes them happen one every twelve shots. I don't heckin' know. Infestation 2 is awesome. I like that. I would like Tarot Cloth, but we're not going to get it. But what we are going to get in a second is those two blue hearts, as long as we don't die to the boss. If we don't die to the boss, we're going to get those two blue hearts, and we're going to be set for uh, getting the deal with the devil on the next floor. It's the haunt. Oh, dear lord, Isaac, what have you done to me? I, I thought I had been nice. I, I thought I was being a good guy to Isaac, you know? It, it's like an it's like a soft indie game, or I guess like a hard indie game? I don't know, it's a soft indie game. And I've been playing it. I, I was just about to talk about how I've had 169.8 hours in this game. Is that not being nice? Am, am I being meaner than I think? And now it gives me that last run, okay, last episode run, it gives us just Agony and pain. That's what this game gives me. Probably a couple aneurysms along the way. Let's get blue cap. Yes, I know it's a health up, and yes, I know it's going to put our health up, and yes, I know it's a tears up, and that's why I took it. Because I'll, I'll take anything that makes me my damage a little bit stronger. Let's get these. Also, just despawn that spider. No, he killed my spider. Rude. That was my best friend. His name was David. Put some respect on David's name. SMH. All right, well, let's go to the next floor with, you know, we're, we're obviously going to use the razor blade. I'm going to wait until we're in a, a fight, though. That way I get more damage ups. Heck, it will do the super unfun room. That is one thing I love about, like, some active items. I, I love that some active items, like the razor blade, you could just spam the button. Like, if you would like a macro for pushing spacebar really quick, you could kill yourself in half a second. I, I think that's pretty entertaining, especially when there's like a sound effect to it. I kind of want to open like an, a modded episode of Isaac. Or just like a modded like YouTube short or something. And just become a character with like 400 red health. Just give myself 400 red health and just pop off, you know? Also, infestation shot. Uh, whenever I kill an enemy with my tears, I spawn a spider. So, if we can get like really, really high damage, we can one-shot enemies and just spawn a crap ton of spiders. I mean, I, I feel like you guys get it by now. Stigmata, damage up. You love to see it. Thanks, bud. And I guess it's a health up, which I don't really want, but we're taking it anyways because it's a damage up. 
So, I mean, our damage ain't bad. Our health is... I don't know, do I want health? This is like a fight I'm eternally gonna have with myself whenever I play Eve runs. Do I want health or do I not? Also, full card. Uh, I can let us go in like the curse room for half the health. That wouldn't be too bad. Uh, we haven't been in our shop yet since so golden key is actually pretty useful. And also, obviously, that golden chest. We will blow this up first, though. Small rock. Beautiful. Finally, a damage up that doesn't cost me health. Damage up, tears up, fat. You love to see it. All right, well, let's go in the shop. Now that we got a little bit of money, we can, I don't know, maybe something's on sale. Nope. All right, just checking. Just checking. Sorry, ma'am. Didn't mean to disturb you in your shop. All right, come on. Give me, give me, I mean, we've had some insane damage ups to start. Like, infestation shot is awesome. You can already tell we got so many spiders. We've got 10 damage, so they're all going to deal like, what is that? To 25? Pretty sure spiders deal 2.5 times your damage, flies are 1.5 times, somewhere around there. So, crap ton of spiders, infinite spiders. Uh, the chariot card is meh? I don't know, we're gonna take the full card over here. We're gonna take the full card and we're gonna check this area, see if there's a library or something. Maybe? I don't know, could, could be, no, no library? Alright, just checking. Wish I had a bomb for that. Apparently not, though. That's fine. You see, this, this is the issue that I have with, like, not always taking my time. Is sometimes, like, if I, I probably spent a bomb for, like, something stupid. I mean, I guess we got small rock. You know what? That's not stupid. I'll take it. Also, I didn't even know we could go to zero hearts, but I guess I'm not complaining. No. Thank you, spiders, for taking out that guy. Meat. Damage and health up. I don't want health ups. Just give me the damage up. Just, just take away the health up, please. Obviously not allowed to take these because deal with the Mega Satan is the plan. Uh, so I guess we'd rather take the Fool teleport card. I don't know, could get like a boss rush or something. We get some easy boss rush stuff, some free swag, you know, you know how it is. Yeah, so I. Th I, I feel like this might might be a very spider heavy run We could get like The shop item that gives our spiders like double damage. That would be awesome Because I mean our damage is fat, but our spiders are fatter, so I'm hoping just to get a massively large damage number That's something I would love to do one day I want to like fight mega satan and I just want to have so many flies are such high damage that they just like one shot him. I, I want to one shot a very strong boss like delirium or something with just like flies like I have to do literally nothing boss just dies that just, that just sounds like the dream my, my panic driven heart would absolutely adore that uh, we're not gonna go in there yet because we could get the shop blow up the shopkeeper increase our deal with the angel chance I don't know some something, something amazing I guess uh nah we don't have any familiars. This is where we start stacking up on the heckin' spiders, if I can kill things. Instead of the spiders killing them. Yeah, so the thing, the, the bad thing about infestation shot is, since it's a shot and not infestation, I only gain a spider when I kill an enemy with my tier. If I kill an enemy with a spider, it doesn't count for infestation. So... Long story short, we really want to kill them with our tears and not the spiders whenever we can help it. We will buy this because, I mean, we just need health. We, we've got too many red hearts. Honestly, I'm kind of sad that we couldn't take Satanic Bible there earlier because that would have given us deal with the devil boss fights. Like after a boss fight, it would give you a deal with the devil item where you can like trade a maximum red heart for it, which would be awesome. Because that would just give us a bunch of ways to get rid of red hearts. And also a bunch of ways to get blue hearts and black hearts. That's a lot of deal with the devil items. I don't know the exact number, but I know that a lot of deal with the devil items just like come with black hearts or blue hearts. I, I feel like deal with the devil's more black hearts and deal with the angels more blue hearts and white hearts. I don't know. I could be missing something. Maybe there's like an entirely different deal thing that I have never heard of. Maybe there's like a... Now oh, deal with the witch doctor. Gives a whole bunch of jungle themed items, I don't know. 
Maybe there's a DLC for that. I got no heckin' clue. Maybe there's a DLC or a mod or something. Deal with the witch doctors adds a bunch of tribal items, which honestly would be really cool. I would, I mean, obviously this game is a whole bunch of religion stuff. I would love if this game was like a whole bunch of like tribal stuff too. Just, just bring every religion in here. Bring in like pagan gods. I'm, I'm sure there's a couple pa pagan gods in here. In Isaac, I don't know. I don't really know my pagan gods very well. So I couldn't tell you if there was one. Oh, I, I can almost guarantee that there's been like mods and stuff for Isaac that adds like Greek gods and stuff, Roman gods, maybe maybe Egyptian gods. I don't know. I feel like Egyptian gods would like perfectly fit the theme of this game though. Like I I wish that there were a crap ton of Egyptian gods in this game. Like imagine, imagine you're just vibing, you kill heckin, you kill this, I don't know, what are they called? What are, what are the half cat, half lion things? I forget what they're called. They've got a crap ton of statues in Egypt. I don't know, you know what I'm talking about. It's in, it's in Mario, so. It's in, it's in the open world Mario for Switch, so obviously you know what I'm talking about. Uh, a bunch of health up, that's awesome. Blue hearts, yes please, with the tears up. Angel Duel, what do we got? We got heckin' Blood of the Martyr. Damage up. Nice. We're gonna blow this guy up. We're gonna really, really try to avoid these purple fires, although it seems unavoidable. They, they seem unavoidable because they're kind of all over the place. Watch out for laser beams. Try to get free damage in there whenever you can, but also avoid the purple fire, please. Thank you. I feel like that should have hit me, but I'm glad it didn't, obviously. You son of a- Oh, that's what- that's what it means by like, don't lose it. When you take the- okay, we've never taken damage when we had it, okay. So it gives you 16 luck, which is obviously fantastic, apparently. It uh, it takes that luck away if you take damage, good to know. Well, we got our key piece, uh, I guess we're gonna take this back then. And... next floor. Alright, not bad, not bad. We, we got a couple- couple interesting items. We've got Blood of the Martyr, which is another massive damage up. With how many damage ups I've gotten, I am very surprised we're only at 8.5 damage. Is that just me? Like, do you get, do you guys feel that vibe too? How are we only at 8.5? Like, what, what do we have? Small Rock, The Meat, Stigmata. Is that it? And also Horde of Babylon? Like, I would have assumed we'd be at like 12 or something. 8.5 seems real low. I mean, I guess, I guess I've been thinking of the tears ups as damage ups, so maybe I'm just convincing myself that we should be more powerful. I mean, we're almost at the maximum tears rate, so we are pretty dang strong. I don't know, I could have, I, like, weren't we at nine damage last floor before Blood of the Martyr? Am I missing something? Are we, like, not actually Whore of Babylon? Have I been baited somehow? I don't know, maybe I'm going crazy. Probably. Oh, dude, if I could get like a, I mean, I don't know. Do we really, do we need a synergy or do we just want like a crap ton of damage? Is this, is this just going to be one of the run where we don't have any synergies, just fat damage? Also, what's the difference? I have no idea what the difference of those are. If we pick up a red heart accidentally or something, or like a health that will pick it up. I'm, if I had to guess, we'd also gain money whenever we use it. Instead of just taking red heart damage, we'd also gain money? I don't know. Couldn't tell you, no clue. Ow, what the? Suicide bomber, that's rude. That was... He just yeeted in there, huh? He really wanted to die. What are you, a heckin' college student? What the heck? That's my job. You're not allowed to do that. Alright, either way. Damage still fat, tears rate still fatter. There we go. These guys are heckin' popping off. I don't know. I, I guess a small story that I have. Uh, two room rerolls consumables on the floor, I think? You know, a, a small story that I have. I, I asked one of my teachers. I was in class today. I had- today was Wednesday, so the disgusting day. I'll talk about that in a second. But I had one of my classes at 8 o'clock in the morning. And I, I put a message in the Zoom call, because obviously it was an online class. I put a message in the Zoom call. Just asking a decently simple question. 
where you could have answered with like literally one math equation that was like four characters long. But it's fine. Teacher, teacher didn't understand understand it, so I, I emailed them with a follow up question just to like clarify what it was so they could answer it. And uh, and he answered with like a four paragraph synopsis where there were like six periods where he was basically just being sassy. There, there, there were like at least six sentences out of the four paragraphs where he was just being sassy and saying like, if you looked inside of the marking analysis synopsis that I've posted within the week two tutorial of our online classes, you would have clearly seen that it says blank. And it's like, first of all, hold this ass. Second of all, you could have explained this with two sentences. Sec like third of all, uh, okay. But what really surprised me was you know, I'm, I'm gonna pull it up because honestly I forget, but he ended the email super weird. Let me pull this up open on the other tab, but I just remember he ended it with one word. I don't remember the word, but I remember the word just sticking with me. And it's like the one other than the answer to the question, like that's the thing that I remember. So let me let me just pull it up real quick. You know, why not? Easy, easy content. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Come on. Come on, internet, you can do it. There we go, he ended it with peace. Like P-E-A-C-E, -E, period. It's just, yeah, let me, let me count. Uh, one, two, three, four, and a half paragraphs. So I'm, I'm actually just gonna copy and paste it in a word to see how many words it is. I know, I know, you're here for Isaac content. You're not here to hear me rant about emails. But this guy actually explained like a four word answer in 353 words. Two pages. Two pages. Look at this. Look at this. Also, I know, that can first name reveal. But look at this. 353 words. Two pages to answer a very, very simple question. Hot dang. What a what a heckin' guy. What, what an absolute guy. Alright, let's get back to that, Isaac. I know you're here for the gaming content, so hot dang. I don't know, I, I just remember reading the piece at the end, and it's like, you just sent me 353 words. 353 words, and you ended with a piece? Like, I'm, I'm honestly surprised that he put a period at the end of it, or that he capitalized it. I don't know whether I should feel, like, disrespected, or... I don't know how to feel, honestly. I don't, I don't I think that's the biggest email that I've ever received. And trust me, African princes have tried to give me their gold like gold deposits before. Like it, as long as I pay them $3,500, they can send it to me. So like hot dang. I've I've received emails from African princes that have like had less words, less wordage. So I don't know. Like honestly, this this guy is like a he's a 3D designer. In real life, like other than being a teacher, his main job is being a 3D designer. So like I would have assumed he'd try to like give short emails, you know, short, concise, straight to the point. Because that's what like 3D design is about. Apparently not. Also Alabaster Box. I still don't know how it works, so I'm not going to take it. Also Steam Cells, awesome. So we're going to take this, we're going to take this, and we're going to take this. I can see forever, sure. Uh, sure, we got money, heck it. Hang man, not that good. I'd rather the full pool. Uh, no, I don't want a health up. Heck, maybe it was like a, no, because we got it from the PhD. I was going to say maybe it was a health down, and then we picked up PhD. Because honestly, I want health downs. <laughs> this never happens. Game, please, I'm begging you give me a health down, dude. Also, this is nice, though. Bonk. 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 There we go. We're now in Horror of Babylon, so we can pay out one more time. Perfect. All right. Uh, yeah, we might as well pick up some red health. Pick up the red health, donate it real quick. Why not make a make a quick buck? Oop! Wait. Oh, that that doesn't line up. All right. Never mind. I'm stupid. Cool. Careful of the fly. the The day that I take damage from one of those flies is the day that I'm assuming YouTube comment section would never let me live it down. I, I've I've just got a feeling. I, I mean, I shouldn't say this because now you guys would actually do it. And I've got one person in mind who would actually do it. You know who you are. 
But I, I feel like every single episode, they, they would put in the YouTube comment section and say like, Hey, remember on episode 158 when you took damage from that fly? You know, just just like makes me want to heckin' <laughs> pain. I mean, luckily I didn't, I, I didn't get hit by one, but one day it's gonna happen. I feel like I've done it some episode way in the past. Ow. Like, taking damage from that fly? That's fine. That's fine, because that's a stupid fly. He's got something cool about him. He's got something special. You know, he shoots diagonally after you kill him. That's not the easiest thing to dodge in the world. It should be easy, but I suck. But like, yeah. We're like, the, the heckin' spinny flies? They're attached to poop, man. Come on, you can, you're better you're better than poop, aren't you? Probably not. I guess I'm just worse than poop. Which honestly wouldn't surprise me. Uh... Oh, there is the hanged man in the shop. If I feel unlazy, I can go... I can go get it and go pick up that yellow chest. Key chest, but... Do I really feel like going all that work for like, probably two pennies? Spending our last coin? Also... I don't even know what hit us there. I was just completely zoned out. I feel like I fell asleep for a second. I don't know. I guess the thing I said I was going to talk about is, uh... Heckin' Wednesdays are my least favorite day of the week. Wednesday, like, usually for most people it's Mondays. No, 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 Wednesdays suck. You wanna know why? I know, high, high school kids in the YouTube comment section complaining right now and calling me a baby. But I have to wake up for class that's at 8 o'clock. I, I've got class at 8. Like, as a kid, that's easy to deal with. You got heckin' child brain. As a heckin' boomer, sure, I know I'm supposed to wake up at, like, five o'clock in the morning every day and drink my coffee and just become miserable for the rest of the day, but heck that. I've got class at eight, and then after the class at eight, I, so it's eight o'clock until one o'clock, also, jerk. I've got eight o'clock until one o'clock, or no, eight o'clock until eleven, and then at one o'clock I have in-person classes until five. And it's not like your average in-person class, it's not like I can just be lazy and do nothing. It's not like you're sitting at a desk, you know, listening to your teacher mindlessly talk about something you don't care about. No, no, no. No, 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 no. I have to be, like, up and active and moving and thinking and heck you, Golden Key, coming out now. Yeah, no. It's like... You can't make me wake up at 8 o'clock and then give me an in-person class two hours later on the same day. Especially when I don't drink coffee. That's just disrespectful. Because I don't, I don't know if I've said this on an episode before, like an Isaac episode before, but I don't drink coffee. Never, never, never have. I mean, I don't drink it for coffee, like the caffeine sake. The only time I ever drink coffee is when I go to the local Timmy's, which, I mean, you guys have heard me talk about a hundred times. But Timmy's, you know, Tim Hortons, it's the McDonald's of Canada. Also, there's a Tinted Rock up there. There we go. Yeah, McDonald's of Canada, yada yada yada, heckin' I've told you about my favorite drink, it's the ice cap, it's basically just a coffee slushy. Tastes delicious, 10 out of 10. That is, that is the only type of coffee that I ever drink. Other than maybe like drinks with caffeine in it, but obviously you don't drink those for the caffeine, like a heckin' root beer. Root beer, I, root beer I drink for the taste, and also the heckin' mouthfeel of the, the carbonation is nice. Oh, so this guy's getting annihilated by our spiders. I love it. Uh, no deal with the angel. Kind of a pain. We got blood clot, which is another weird damage up. And I guess we go to the next floor. I mean, oh no, I really should have grabbed the hangman. That was lazy. I could have gotten two golden chests for free. That's my bad. If we lose this run, blame me. I'm sorry. That's my bad, dude. Uh, telepathy for dummies is nice. Monster manual is me. I don't know, I guess we might as well use it. We're obviously not gonna take it, but we're gonna use it. Uh, so we are gonna take telepathy for dummies with us. Although we're probably gonna go get, uh, like if we lose Horror of Babylon, we're gonna come back for the uh, heckin' razor blade. What the, okay, that's a lot of boys. That was, I don't know why, but I wasn't expecting that many boys in that small of a room. Also, little pins? No little pins. Thank goodness. They got lucky that time. 
Also, I mean, of all the things for Monster Manual to give us, I'm totally down to receive heckin' Ice Ice Baby. Save the moment. Uh, I still don't actually know how long it lasts. I know it like freezes enemies in place. I don't know how long it lasts though. Like, does it freeze them for 30 seconds? For a minute? Does it freeze them for half a millisecond? I don't know. Also, might as well use Magician here. Makes, makes this guy easier to kill from across the room. Mainly because my accuracy sucks. Accuracy? Accuracy sucks. But you know, what are you gonna do? Also, just because I figured you guys have a right to know. You, you have a right to know how much I'm disrespecting you right now. I am pre-recording an episode. <gasps> I know, crazy. I'm recording this at 10.52, the night before it'll be posted. Also, I did not mean to pick that up. Yeah, I am, I am recording this the night. How did that hit me? Wait, what? it was an ice form. Wait, what? It was, it was ice. How did they, how did they, how did, how did, how did, I thought you couldn't get hurt by ice. I'm confused. I wish for death. Also, I forgot to get the golden razor blade to test it out. So I guess heck that. Yeah, like what, what the heck was that? How did, how did the what what hit me? Also, uh, this is the mom fight, so be careful. That also means we only have two floors to get a deal with an angel, so please, game, do not be a jerk. I, I know last episode, you were a jerk. Don't be a jerk. Please, I, I don't want five unlikely deal with the devils in a row. Again, please. I beg of you, that was agonizing. What do you got? Sharp plug. Uh, taking damage gives you space bar charge. Also, oh, this is a health up, right? Yeah, don't want that. You, I want you. Card, what do you got? The stars. Uh, no. Key, sure, we'll buy. Sharp plug. We got a crap ton of money, so we might as well increase our deal with the angel chance by blowing up this nerd. I mean, I guess we take the magician? Alright, uh, we're not gonna make boss rush. So I don't have to worry about a teleport card. Tele tele teleport card? Teleport card or anything. Nice, nice. Also, yeah, my brain is still racking. What the heck hit us there? What what hit us there? What, what was that? What's hitting me? Oh, it's they they had a jumpy boy. Okay. At least this one makes sense. The previous one, heckin' What the heck, Isaac? You're better than that. Don't don't hit me with a frozen boy. You know the frozen boys don't deal damage. Absolutely terrible. You really think you know a game, huh? Really think you know a game and then it pulls some crap like that. SMH. Like, now I'm afraid to touch the Frozen Boys. Like, you shouldn't be afraid to touch the Frozen Boys. You should feel safe. Like, is this gonna hit me? No. Why the last one? Was, was there like an enemy inside of it? Was, was he frozen, like cuddling his favorite teddy bear and his teddy bear was an explosive? I'm confused. Also, uh, we want the razor blade. Oh, I th do we save magician for like Mega Satan? Do we do we save magician for Mega Satan? Is it worth saving for that long? I mean, problem or would we rather arrow walk? Honestly, since Mega Satan has phases, I don't think arrow walk is that good. I don't think the Arawak is that good, but I mean, honestly, I'd rather have Arawak. So I, I think we will take Arawak. Alright, hopefully we don't get cucked. Also, why did I go in here? I don't know why I went in here. No clue. We, we already got our special floor, special room of the floor, aka the library. So, uh, yeah, let's fight Mom. 8.5 damage. We're gonna get a couple spiders, not many. She doesn't... He doesn't summon too many enemies. Alex, should I airwalk mom? Honestly, heck it, why not? Heck mom. Wait, she doesn't freeze. Wait, what? What? What What do you mean she doesn't freeze? It's airwalk. What the heck? I, I thought airwalk meant that everything was frozen. In that case, if I used this on Mega Satan, I would have been hecked. I would have been absolutely hecked. Okay, well, I'm glad I used it now. Uh, we'll grab the Polaroid, we'll grab this Blue Heart. Let's go in here, which is awesome. Uh, we will take Monstrance, which... I don't even remember what it does. Doesn't it, like, reflect some enemy tears or something? I think? 
I got no hidden clue. All I know is our damage is decent. So there we go. We got the key piece. We're going to fight Mega Satan as long as we don't die. So that is officially the goal. That is the goal of the run. Don't die. If I can get like a deal with the devil now, that would be awesome because now I could trade away some health for some blue hearts. Be, oh, there's a little, little, little pin. There's a little, little pin. He's so fast. He's so fast, dude. He's fast as heck, boy. Fast as heck. All right. So if I were to ask for any item in the game, what would it be? I would ask for the wafer. Wait, wafer would be the best item in the game for us. Change my mind. Literally nothing can like ever beat the wafer once you're on the womb. Like before the womb, eh, it doesn't make that big of a difference. I mean, you know what? Here, heckin', it's been it's been a couple episodes since we did one. What does the wafer do? I I won't I won't say for like another minute or so. What does the wafer do? This is this is for the YouTube comment section. This is this is your pop quiz for the day. This is this is so that I can test to make sure that you guys are paying attention in class. Also, it looks like purifying light hurts enemies when they stand in the light. How much is it? It's not bad. That's some good damage. Interesting. Interesting. What do you got in you? Nothing good. Cool. All right, just checking. But yeah, what does the wafer do? I'll, I'll give you a hint. It looks like a pillow with a belly button. That's that's your hint. It looks like a pillow with a belly button. What does it do? Also, can I just kill these guys with like purifying light? Looks like it doesn't deal much damage to bosses, which is kind of sad. Speaking of not dealing much damage to bosses, how's this guy doing? I think, I think this is the longest it's ever actually taken for me to kill this guy. Usually this guy's dead in like an instant. I guess our run just sucks right now. Which is fair. Angel deal by the sounds of it. Yep. Also Cracker Jack's not going to take it. The candle? Sure, I'll take it. Pastoral candle, keep the flame burning. Gives us a tears up as long as we don't take damage, I think. Uh, Cracker Jacks. No, it's an HP up. I don't want red health. I do not want red health. I want Horror of Babylon. I mean, I don't know. At this point, like, should I just take it? We've, we've gotten so many damage ups. I mean, we've gotten a bunch of damage ups. So, like, would you rather four HP or... I don't know, would we, would we rather 4 HP or would we rather have, like, 70% extra damage? Also, that's 4 regeneratable HP. Honestly, I think we, I think we just start to take the health. I mean, I know it's a little bit late for, like, some of it. Like, we've, we've skipped a whole bunch of health recently. It's a little bit late for all the health, but, like, honestly, we've been getting so much HP ups, so we might still get more. Also, this is Utero 2, so this is going to be the It Lives fight, which is fair. Oh, I guess now's the time to decide. You know, we'll, we'll wait until we got a bunch of hearts on the floor. If, if we get a whole bunch, if we can get four hearts on the floor, I'll do it. I'm, I'm not going to trade two hearts for 70% of our damage, or I guess 30% of our damage. We're not going to trade two hearts for 30% of our damage, but four hearts, I guess I will. Although, Paschal Candle is awesome because it goes way above the maximum tears rate. The sun card is also fantastic. Uh, I will take the White Heart, heck it. Oh, in that case, I hope we get another deal with Angel. 24% chance, by the way. Because if we got another one, that means we get another item for free and we get to keep our health, which apparently now I care about. But also, let me go here. We, we officially got enough... So we're gonna grab all the health now. Yeah, so our damage went down 3.19. That, that, that's around like down like what 30, 35%-ish? Oh, let's grab this red heart. That's that's around 35%. Uh I'm not gonna grab that heart, heck you. Yeah, I, I just did that because now we can pick up the sun. We can pick up the sun because I was keeping the lovers so that we had some backup health, but I mean, the lovers gives us two hearts, the sun gives us four. Or five, or whatever we're at right now. I think we're at five. You? Why did you blow? You're not supposed to blow. Like, yet or at all. What the heck? Who told you you could blow? That's just disrespectful. 
There we go. Alright. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Question mark card, double active. Uh, no. That will use our razor blade twice and attempt to kill us. Also, I didn't grab the sun card. But we, we're not going to need the sun card anytime soon. If I take seven damage on one room, I deserve it. I think we're on like nine hearts. So if, if, if we manage to die from one room, I deserve it. That, that's just bad on my part. I think honestly the chariot's better. Heck it, I'll open you. I've kind of abandoned them and also that was very worth it. Uh, You are allowed to go back after the it lives fight, so I think I want to take the chariot, honestly. I think I want to take the chariot into the it lives fight. I don't know. If, if we were a couple seconds faster, we could have made hush. What the? He's zooming. Okay. Really wish I didn't take damage there. Because that way we'd have a higher tears rate for this fight. But what are you going to do? We're going to wait until the first two waves of enemies are done. Ow. Fucking dang it. That's decent damage. I don't know, the... It is helping. Like the weird light. The light's helping. That shouldn't have hit me, but okay. Sometimes these Isaac hitboxes are a little bit funky. Change my mind. They're, they're a little bit jank sometimes. Oh, he's not dead. I thought he was dead. There we go. No deal, sadly. Mystery side gave us a golden key. Okay. Uh, we're still not on red hearts, which is very nice. I wish we could take two cards with us, but we didn't get tarot cloth at the start of the run. So I guess we take the sun and go, right? I guess so. I don't, know, I don't see anything else that I could do. Anything else that's cool. We've got the Polaroid. Okay. Making sure I'm not hacking myself over in any way, shape, or form. Even though that's what I do best. We still kept that white heart, which is awesome. Careful. There we go. Two of spades. Doubles our key. Sure. I had to like triple check in my head that it didn't say ace of spades. Because ace of spades would have converted our sun card. Yeah, so right now we've got, you know, seven and a half plus five seven and a half plus five we've got twelve and a half hearts and so we can take damage 13 times maximum so if we could get more blue hearts or ma more maximum red hearts preferably more maximum red hearts that'd be awesome also yes I'm very glad that I made the conscious decision to get rid of Whore of Babylon very very glad I did that you can go back after the Isaac fight so we'll take the devil like, I mean, you can you can leave the room after you fight it. So we'll take the devil, increase our damage for the fight. Gonna count on purifying light over here to wreck these freaks. Also, it looks like the light actually does summon spiders. So as long as it's not the spiders killing an enemy, it summons spiders. That's fair. I mean, it would be extremely overpowered if killing something with spiders gave you spiders. That would be too OP. Also, high tears rate is not very fun against this guy. Because he is going to be flying. There we go. Uh, we'll pick it up at the end of the floor. But that is good. That is good. I'm not complaining. That's awesome. Thank you. Thank you, game. Blackheart is coming in clutch. We're not going to pick it up, though. I'd rather take red heart damage. So if we lose our two blue hearts, or one and a half. That's technically two. If we lose our two blue hearts, I'd rather take red heart damage than black heart damage. So we have more health for the final fight. Oh, that's not an enemy. That's an enemy. I, I was trying to shoot the weird guy, and he wasn't taking damage. It was weird. Alright. If we get red hearts to drop, we can use the hangman. Also, heck that, heck you, heck me. Purifying light, get in there. Thank you. Give me some spiders while you're at it, you weenie. That was close. Alright. Oh god, this sucks. Just, just, I, uh, just hide here. Purifying light, carry me. Carry me, daddy. Please! There we go. Thank you. Oh. 
pain. That's just rude. I don't much appreciate trapping me in a corner with a bomb. I didn't sign up for this. I mean, I did. I signed up for it. This t that should not have hit. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I mean, we are at 1.03 speed. I guess maybe I'll accept the fact that it hit me. Also, I should probably go get the sun card because we could die here very easily, apparently. I was really hoping to bring the sun card to the Mega Satan fight. I really hope we don't need to use it this floor. Pain. Hanged man. I mean, that can get us in our curse room for just one heart, which is good. But we're not getting any red heart drops. If I were getting red heart drops, I would absolutely do that, but we haven't gotten any yet. So I'm, I'm just a little bit suspicious right now. Four monstros, probably not good. Sick eight monstros, really? Eight monstros on this room, huh? That's so. Eight monstros when I don't have Horde of Babylon or like any good damage ups? Sick. Yeah, that sounds about right. Oh, well, we have to use our sun card here, which sucks. Oh, look at that, finally, a red heart. Pain. <laughs> Stars card, where do you take me? Right here, okay. Seeker room. Like you got super greed, I was itching my nose, you jerk. I am, like, I'm I'm letting you vibe. I, I let you chill here for 41 minutes after your, after the game told you that you had to exist. Can I stop taking damage, please? What is wrong with me? I have a good thing going on here. Why am I trying to ruin it? What am I doing? What am I smoking and how do I stop? Please. So why can I not go? I've never seen this before. You're not allowed to bomb into challenge rooms? Why? What? I've never seen that before. That's fucking weird. Don't take damage from a blue fire. All right, well, uh, this sucks nuts out the wazoo. Uh, we now have four hearts to fight Isaac, which I am not a fan of. We're gonna take the devil card. Okay, well, hopefully we can get some red hearts to drop at some point. Because we, like, we've only gotten one red heart to drop this entire floor. That kind of sucks, seeing as how we turn this into a red heart run. I don't know, like maybe, if, if I lose this run, if we manage to not kill Mega Satan, which I think would be impressive, but if we manage to not kill Mega Satan this run, I guess I can blame it on me not transitioning early enough into a Red Heart run. Also the Sun card revealed the floor, I forgot about that. But uh, yeah, I guess I could blame this on me not transitioning fast enough. Also, heck it. I'm gonna, I learned my lesson, I'm gonna go back, get the Hanged Man, blow that up, come back, bring the Devil, actually wait a minute. If I were smart, what I should do is like drop the devil here. There we go. Grab Ace of Spades. Now we go over here. This is a lot of walking, by the way, because after we fight Isaac, we have to come back, get that white heart, get the black heart, obviously. Now we get the hangman. Oh. Oh, like, have we gotten any good space bar items? Like, we could have taken uh, the heckin' telepathy as well. Oh, if I transitioned one floor earlier, this run could have been so much better. The lighter. Nah, not that good. Luckily, I was smart and put a, a devil right here. But yeah, I'm, I, I really wish that we transitioned one floor earlier. This run could have been so much better. I don't know, I guess, I guess that's part of the, the fun of Eve is deciding whether you're going to have a red heart or a no red heart run. I, I've been trying to force a no red heart run because we haven't gotten many damage ups in our in our recent runs. Also, one cent away from being nice. But yeah, we have we have been seriously lacking in the damage department recently. So I guess I've been taking Horror of Babylon, or I, I've been worshiping Horror of Babylon because it's like if the game's gonna give me a damage up, no matter what, I'm gonna use it, and that is a bad idea apparently. Good to know. Also, we're just going to take one of these. Don't ask me why. We're, we're only going to take one cent. Well, I guess here it goes. There's the devil card, which is basically Horde of Babylon. So as long as we survive, we're going to fight Mega Satan. 
or at least we have the option to fight Mega Satan. We might decide, hey, it would be smarter if I didn't fight Mega Satan and like fought the rest of the floor, maybe get some health up, damage up items. Although it looks like we're not gonna have the chance to because I absolutely suck at this game. I mean, you know what? I, I think I know what the issue might be. I'm in a weird position right now. I had like my butt on top of my foot, which is not exactly optimal for gaming. Also, I pushed a button. What hit me there? There was nothing there. I don't know what hit me. I, I think my butt being on top of my foot was my ultimate demise. Oh god, you gotta sprint! There's still a chance. Like, imagine if we had the sun card. We would have zero worries here. It's still doable. I just need to not mess it up royally, please. I wanna ask much of myself. I, I only ask for the simple things. As long as we don't get corner cucked, we should be fine. Come on, man. Low speed, don't betray me now. Come on, please. He's so low, don't corner cuck me. Okay, we're good. God, yes. Yes, no, not delirium, heck you. No, <laughs> that, that's, that's a hard no from me. Thank you, but no, I'm good. All right, let's go get that black heart, that white heart. Not, I swear if I died to that fire there, I would have. Oh, my brain. I'm, I'm doing the classic dad rub his forehead. Uh, rub right now. I am just... Ooh. Agony. Alright, let's go to the next floor. I guess I'll check for the super secret room real quick, because maybe, just maybe, it'll be that special secret, like, that special super secret room that's just filled with, like, ten red hearts. Maybe. I have no idea where it is, but it could be somewhere. My best guess is here? No, or here. After that, I got nothing. All right, let's go to the next floor. Heck you. You... Take a bomb. Don't even, don't even, don't even try. Don't, don't even, don't even try to bait me, Isaac. I am not falling for your bullcrap right now. I am, mm -mm, mm -mm. no, I refuse to fall for your bullcrap right now. Ice baby, sure, headless baby, meh. That, sure, that may. I mean, I'll take prayer card. It sucks to get it this late on, but it's nice to have it. So I think we take prayer card and explore with that. Because if, if I can make six rooms without taking red heart damage, aka losing the white heart, then we get a max red heart container and also a red heart. So we're gonna save the full card for basically if we have to fight heckin black bandage boy because he sucks because if if we do we're gonna take damage on him so don't fall in the hole 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 okay really wish we got car battery we we saw it a couple shops ago but we didn't actually have the opportunity to pick it up which sucks you son of a dang it should not have been hit there Pain. All right, don't eat, bro. I swear, dude. Stop. Also, we lost our white heart, so. I don't know, I guess we're exploring for battery charges now. Am I that desperate? Yes. Yes, I am. We're exploring for battery charges because heck you, game. Looking for battery charges. Hoping to get some heckin' white hearts. What am I doing? What am I smoking? Dude, it's a heckin' Wednesday. Stop, <laughs> please. Oh, that's a weird position. Heckin' when mom cooks the chicken nuggies just right. You know? That is a nice heckin' screenshot, though. Like, if you wanna screenshot that, use it in a tweet or something, I probably will, too. That was just a nice frame-perfect shot. Also, heck, where is our damage? Where did our damage go, dude? Holy jabezes. What happened to us? We, we used to be so good. We used to be so powerful. And then I came along and just decided, nah, heck you. Rosary. Fan. Flippantastic. 10 out of 10 item right now. I don't know what happened. I don't know if, like, my leg fell asleep and I couldn't tell. Also, this sucks. Okay, we're good. Health up. Shot speed up. See, now I wish I had those, like, six health up pills from before. That'd be nice. 
Where were all those health pills at, that you were throwing at me earlier with PhD? I, I think there were two health up pills that we didn't take because we thought we were going for a red heart run. I don't know, dude. Isaac's just built diff. Also, I did use a prayer card on time. It was very close to not being on time, but it was on time. Don't hit me, please. I need this white heart, dude. If you're not going to give me red hearts, at least let me keep this white heart. At least let me keep this white heart. That's all I ask. Real? No, no, no secret room, huh? This run's also been pretty mean with the secret rooms, too. I think I've only ever gotten one secret room and one super secret room somewhere along. You heckin' please, dude. Agni My shield was up. My shield was. I refuse, Isaac. I refuse to accept this. This is not canon. Also, where did I lose one cent? I am now officially not at the funny number. Thank you, Mystery Sack. Mystery Sack has officially given me more run, more health than this Isaac run. Oh, what is, no, 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 heck you. Absolutely not. I refuse to even think about doing that. Heck you, Isaac. Heck you. All right, these guys should be easy. What the, what? How come? You can shoot them to knock them back, and it knocks them towards you. America, explain. Please. I don't even know what to believe anymore. I don't know what's happening. Two more rooms, then we get the White Heart payout. Just please, Isaac. Do you I don't even know what to say at this point. I don't, I don't even know. I've got absolutely zero clue. Heckin' what is even going on? I can't even kill two lusts. Th this run seemed so good, and then I went for the red heart transition, and then it just decided, you know, no red heart for you. Mm -mm, nope, you're you're being cut off. You know, it's like I'm I'm the drunk guy at the party. They cut me off when I've only had half of a drink. You know what? Heck it. If I die here, I die. If I don't die, I don't die. I'm going for it. I don't care what this game heckin' says. Also, I will absolutely die if I take this. Do I want to risk it for the biscuit? Honestly, just give me the name. Just all I, I know I'm going to lose this run, just give me the name. Evil Charm, luck up, you feel protected. Alright, well, I'm glad that I used the prayer card, because I would have died. Obviously, now we don't get the white heart, but I don't even think there's six more rooms to explore. And so we're kind of just hecked, because I know I can't beat Mega Satan with this run without taking damage. I don't know about you guys, but I know I'm hecked. I'm going to kill Gluttony last, because hopefully he'll give us a health up. It is possible. That he could give us, like, a lard. No, he did give us some health, though. Like, I feel like we should be saving up the blue hearts, but, like, I'm going to die if I don't have them. I, I want to save up the blue hearts so we could have, like, an extra five health for the fight, but... I will die if I don't have blue hearts. Also, thank you for the money. Now, maybe, maybe that's why the run just became so terrible out of nowhere. It's because we lost that penny for no reason somewhere. It was like the super greed that took it away? Maybe, I don't know. Alright, grab that red heart. My, my, I'm gonna have like chafing going on on my forehead if I keep rubbing it at this rate. <laughs> This has been agonizing. <laughs> All right, what's up, guys? How you doing? How are the vibes? How are the kids? Kids are good. Sounds good. How's the wife? Still single. Sounds good. No! Oh, it's over. Runs over. I I just picked up the worst item in the entire game. I just picked up the worst item in the entire game, which honestly. If there's any Isaac modders, I have an item for you. Call it the 70th cent. It gives you 79 pen, or it gives you 70 cents, but it gives you like luck minus three. Banger item, change my mind. You know what? We might as well collect it at this point. We're we're already past the point of unheckening. We are we are in full heck mode. 
Also, heck it, we'll take Headless Baby. I don't know why not. I was hoping for like a reroll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was hoping for a reroll. Clearly not going to get one though. A little bit past that point. I mean, sadly, the only thing keeping us alive is prayer card at this point. And not in the fun way. Not not in the receive white hearts, receive red hearts way. There we go. He's dead. Cool. What's this card? Full health. Ancient recall. Draw three cards. Three hematomesis. Hierophant. Awesome. Emperor. Meh. Double emperor. If this were a hush run, I'd be creaming right now. <gasps> I got... No, heck you. No, go away. Please. I'm no, I don't know why I'm using this. I'm going to die on this room. It's for protection. Personal protection. Yeah, I can't dodge fast enough. It's like a train. Even if I'm walking away from it at an angle, I still take damage. He's too fast for my little legs. I feel like a heckin' child in front of a runaway bus. It's terrible. My little legs. I'm only on 1.33 speed, man, and I can't even fly. But yeah, this run we have gotten like zero synergies. Actually, the number zero synergies. It's kind of crazy. Isaac's tears. Heck it. Well, it's going to do literally nothing, but sounds like fun. What do we, what do we got? Oh boy. Three health Satan. Three health Satan. Well, we're dead. <laughs> I don't know how, but I've been taking damage this whole time. <laughs> Sounds good. Another decent run thrown away for nothing. Like, what? I just, out of nowhere, just damage out the wazoo, not getting any red hearts. I think I just, like, lost my fighting spirit. So, tomorrow we're gonna do something else. I think I've lost the Eve spirit. I think, I think it's broken me slightly, so we'll... I'll probably do a Lazarus run tomorrow. I'm probably gonna record it in about 20 seconds because I'm pre-recording because tomorrow's gonna suck. It's another 8 a.m. day. But uh, yeah, everybody, thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a fantastic day and I will see you tomorrow. Okay, bye.